Hey everyone, welcome to the Shemmies. Tonight we are doing some sliders, donut battered sliders. I'll tell you what, Joanne's made the, the dough. It's fantastic, we're deep frying them. Come on over here and have a little bit of a look. See here, you guys, it's gonna be great. Donut sliders with the Shemmies. There's no sugar, there's no glaze, there's no nothing. You make that there, you cut one of them in half just like a hamburger bun. Ketchup, mustard, mayo, Thousand Island, whatever you're putting in there. Lettuce, tomato, onions, pickles, you name it, you got her. And uh, just perfect. So I'm barbecuing right now. We got some bratwurst sausages going. And uh, we got some of these here floating in there as you can see. Beautiful. You're hanging with the chamois. We're doing donut sliders. We got some bratwurst and burger like I said. As you can see, that's buffalo burger right there. Perfect, you guys. It's going to be fantastic. We got to flip this here. So I'm going to have to let you go. Johnny, you're going to flip them, John? You betcha. Right on. And I'm going to get these on the barbecue. Okay. I'll be right back, you guys. Thanks. So you guys, while we're doing our uh, burger here, our patties, building our patties here for our donut sliders, is I want to just make them a little bit bigger because you know they are going to shrink. Lots of times people forget that and they shrink up a little bit and then they don't match the buns very well. You want more burger than you do bun. Mind you, them donut buns are pretty good actually, i got to admit. So that's a, it's a, it's a toss up. But anyhow, make them a little bit bigger like that. They're going to go on the cube and uh, we're going to let them buck and then into uh, that donut there. It's going to be so good, you guys. This here, just 80, 20, Chuck. Look out, it's awesome. You know Chuck, he don't give a, oh, never mind. <laughs> okay, right on, see you at the queue, there we go. What you doing out here, John? Well, what we're doing here is we're getting these ready for our sliders, and here we are, you guys, it's fall. It's supposed to snow lots tomorrow. Uh, excuse the mess, the barbecue's a little messy. I've been cooking lots, we had some people over there, been rocking and rolling, keeping busy. Uh, a buddy of mine did some sliders the other weekend. There was moose burger. It was just excellent. Brody Bexton there. Uh, he's a good dude. He he flanged up some uh, yeah beautiful sliders. And moose burgers were just deadly. Um, so that got me kind of on the slider kick here with the donuts uh, with our batter because uh, we do, we have done meatball you know um, meatball uh, battered donut battered uh, meatballs. And I'll tell you what, you guys, those are fantastic. They're so good. And um, like I said, you just put whatever you want in them and go to town and just smell this. It's beautiful. Now this. Uh, 80, 20 buffalo chuck, it's <laughs> buffalo burger. Uh, it's not gonna flare up too bad because it's pretty low in fat, as you can see. I did add a little extra fat to it. I don't quite know if it's 80, 20. I'm just doing that to you guys. But I do usually, if I do beef, it's 80, 20 and I grind my own beef. So that way I can eat it kind of, I like it about medium, medium rare. Uh, not medium rare, medium well. A little bit pink, just a little pink. And it's good, so anyhow, I gotta go flip some buns, you guys. Love you. come on back. Taste testing's coming, can't wait. Come on, John. Hey everybody, welcome to my favorite part of the show. As always, the taste tester right here, loving it. So we did our sliders. Johnny did the, the beautiful donut batter buns. These are just excellent. I don't know whether to smear peanut butter and strawberry jam all over these and start going to town, but I'll tell you what, this is another great way to uh, doctor up a donut is with these sliders, love it. So what we got here, you guys have a good look there. There's our Johnnyville brat. We've got our Buffalo burger barbecued up, of course. I always like to put black pepper on my fixings. I don't know if you guys do that or not. It just adds a little extra flavor. It's perfect, just excellent. We got some sauerkraut, some onions, some pickles. These are all things I like. Remember, do what you like. Put her on. There we go. We got our beautiful bun, as you guys can see. So let's just do this, you guys. Now, I love going a little mustard on the bottom. Get it in with that beef, you guys. I'll tell you, look out. And what I do there is I just land a couple of beautiful pickles. Beautiful pickles go in and some onion which is uh, of course French for onion. And this goes in just like that. Onion, pickles, some mustard, we're rocking and rolling. Now, on top of the operation, we're gonna just bust that apart. We're gonna go all oh, these donut buns that Joanne did, like we're doing donuts and she's got this dialed right in there. So light, fluffy and tender. It's amazing how tender they are. Can't even tell you, they're just beautiful. Just gonna make a perfect slider. I don't, I don't even know if this is legal, it's, it's that good. So then we get a little mayo like that, that's how I like it, just right there. You can do uh, lettuce, tomato, you name it, whatever you want to throw on there, go for it. Don't fool around. There we have that. I'm going to do that right there. And just for good measure, I'm going to land one more pickle in there. Just for the heck of it. Beautiful. Have a look at that. Donut slider right there. Number one down and gone. Now you got company coming over, you got a party going on doing whatever you're doing, you guys. Whip up some burger patties. Like I said, 80, 20, chuck, this is buffalo. Threw a little extra fat in, away you go. Drop an egg in there, whatever kind, original chips, crackers, crumbs, you name it. Get it all together, salt, pepper, garlic, uh, flange it all up. I put a little uh, KD cheese sauce sprinkle in there just for extra flavor. 
And there that's like, yeah, that's how you do that. Some pepper, some cayenne. Oh. <laughs> like, I'll tell you what you gotta do. Sorry. <clears throat> Next cheat day. <laughs> get your calendar out, <clears throat> write donut sliders, thanks to the shemmies, and you circle it. Because it's gonna be <laughs> that good. Mmm, awesome. Oh. Okay, I'd love to just finish that right now, you guys, but I gotta show you another thing. Donut bun slider, in it goes. Now, what we're gonna do here is we got some, we got a Johnnyville, Johnsonville brought, my favorite. Just so awesome. Get them on the queue, roll them around, look out. Land some ketchup, mustard, you can put pickles in here, whatever, onion. Um, I go like this, I land a little onion in there, folks, as you guys can see. Just like that. Let's throw a pickle in there for good measures. We're a little short on pickles over there, but that's okay. I'll make it work. And then here I got some uh, uh, Billy Jane and Robbie Alexander sauerkraut, homemade, locally sourced, of course. Just across town. I'll tell you, those boys got her dialed in. I don't know what it is, but they got her dialed in. And then I just lay my bratwurst in there. Something different to go with the sliders when you're entertaining or just hanging out with the fam, whatever. Hey, there it is, you guys. Look at that. Right there. Fantastic. Let me tell you how good that's going to be. I already know. Oh my, like, oh. <laughs> mm. You guys, <clears throat> you're rocking and rolling with the shemmies. I'll tell you what, <clears throat> I wish I could feed y'all because it's that good. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. The shemmies donut sliders, bang on. Just absolutely fantastic. So, thanks so much you guys for uh, hanging out with us. Please go to YouTube, uh, subscribe. Hit a like or two and uh, hang out with us. Uh, and send me any of your recipes, ideas. You got some recipes you want me to find up. I will give you a shout out and I'll try cooking it. It's great. Thanks for hanging with the chamois. I love you all.